Hey guys, hope you're having a great evening. Um, just want to do another video. I figured out a way to mount my camera onto, or my phone, onto the uh, hood. I'll show you the contraption one day. Um, I have about um, 4,000 kilometers on the on this oil change now. And the car has been sitting for a while. It's nice and cool. It's, uh, so it's probably going to be a little bit higher than normal. But if you guys can see that, it's about uh, three, two, two millimeter, like two millimeters above the uh, that um, full mark. See that. which is fine and um, I don't smell anything in the oil yeah there's no no gas smell so that's good um, that means the uh, the oil dilution right now is it's, uh, it's uh, been cured for now so I'll uh, continue to monitor um, but I did want to do a quick video on uh, on something else um, I was, uh, just listening to another podcast type of YouTube video and they were talking about the Cybertruck, um, uh, range anxiety and, uh, some of the new features. Um, the, the new Cybertruck is on a 48 volt architecture. And also another thing that they were touting was um steer by wire so basically your steering wheel when you turn it it's digital you turn it it speed compensates and why this one why as well What's the point? You guys tell me. Are you guys getting a lot uh, higher charge times? Charging. And uh, what else? Um, performance. Really? Where is it? Other than the zero to 60, which, you know, the other uh, Teslas already have, 0 to 60. And steer by wire, why? Do you guys really want uh, to have the risk of digital steering? What happens when it fails? Or what, what, if, what if the computer crashes? You, you guys know that you know if your screen and your Tesla goes off, it's done. It actually, you can't do anything. You guys, steer by wire. Let's just put it this way. Do you guys really want to be in the way of a 6,000 pound SUV, stainless steel SUV, like a knife going down the road when this thing, the steer by wire fails? Why would it fail? Well, you tell me. Why would the, why would the control panel on a, on a, on any car fail or why would your iPad or your iPhone crash uh, yeah it, it's it's this stuff is pretty much just marketing jargon um, you know things to make people say wow you know what it is total utter garbage it's just a high risk uh, low reward you know, for, for the people who have the money to spend on something like this. Um, you know, but what I know, I'm a just a, you know, Honda driver, limited funds, right? So you guys tell me, I'm jealous, right? So you, you tell me. But, I t but one thing for sure is that when I see one of those cyber trucks down the road, not going to be anywhere close to it right anything that looks like that 
I'll be standing far away or um, just avoiding it really. You guys tell me what you think.